morning and welcome to Berwick Mitsubishi. My name's Mark and I'm going to take you for a walk around our 2012 Ford Territory Titanium 7-seater wagon this morning. We'll start off at the front of the car and uh, we'll just highlight a few things. Um, a few minor little touch-ups uh, just from some stone chips as you'd expect based on the age of the car. Uh, as you can see it does have uh, are they daytime running lamps? I'm not 100% sure, but uh, as we move around to the driver's side of the car, factory alloy wheels and present in fairly good condition. A couple of little minor scuff marks, brand new tyres that we've fitted to the front of this car. Uh, we do have colour-coded exterior mirrors and door handles with our ind indicator predominantly in the uh, exterior mirror. It is an all-wheel drive as indicated by the badge, which we'll chat about a little bit later. Um, and as we scan down the uh, driver's side of the car, as you can see, it presents really well. A minor little scuff mark on the right-hand rear alloy wheel, and the rear tyres are probably 90% tread. So all round our tyres have got uh, certainly plenty of life in them. As we move around to the back of the car now, a few things that we'll point out. Uh, it does have uh, colour-coded reverse sensors, does also have reverse camera as well, um, and fitted with a tow bar. Being the all-wheel drive in a diesel, it does have capacity to tow 2.7 tonne, and as you can see, fitted with all the ancillary plugs as well. Now as we move around to the passenger side of the car, uh, once again, presentation extremely consistent um, minor scuffs on our left hand rear alloy wheel as well um, obviously they're just cosmetic things but uh, i like to highlight those to you a very minor little scratch on the left hand rear door uh, but overall the presentation of the exterior of the car uh, is fairly impressive it does have uh, weather shields on both of our front doors as well um, and the overall exterior condition oh, i'm quite happy with actually back around at the front of the car now we'll have a little bit of a chat about the performance of the car more importantly being a diesel the economy as well so being a uh, 2.7 litre diesel turbo diesel of course uh, it's going to give us 140 kilowatts of power and 440 newton meters of torque but deliver us nine litres combined per 100 k, so great economy. So 75 litre fuel tank capacity will give us in excess of 830 kilometres to a tank of diesel. So around at the tailgate of the car, a couple of options as far as access goes. On the right hand side here, we can just push the, uh, the right hand side button, which just releases the glass door, um, gives us access into the rear of the car uh, just via this opening. Um, in the event that we want to get access uh, completely, close that back and press the button on the left hand side, which releases the entire tailgate. As you can see, comes well up out of our way in excess of six foot. Um, and you can see the sort of area that we have for our passengers. Seven seats, of course, full leather interior being a titanium. And uh, once again, paying attention to how well this car presents as well. And uh, small storage area just in there. When the seven or the third row seats are utilised, you have that storage area there as well. So here we are inside the Ford Territory now, and we'll just run through all the features of the car. Mind you, paying particular attention to how well it presents and uh, has been looked after. On our driver's uh, armrest, so we've got all of our power window switches. A little bit of wear to a couple of the switches there, consistent with age once again. And then right up the top, our controls for our exterior mirrors, electric mirrors of course. Uh, moving to the steering wheel now, which is height and reach adjustable, so it is a telescopic steering wheel. As you can see, set ourselves up where we're nice and comfortable. Just push that lever back into position and lock it away. Auto headlights as standard in the Titanium. All of our uh, cruise control switches on our right hand side of our leather wrapped steering wheel. And then all of our audio and Bluetooth controls on our left hand side. Moving into the uh, center console section now, as you can see, we do have satellite navigation. Uh, as we mentioned earlier, we do also have reverse camera. 
um, with a really clear picture behind us. So certainly extremely safe when we're reversing. Below that, all of our controls for our dual zone climate control air conditioning and all of our controls for our audio there with CD player as well. Uh, storage compartment in here with a 12 volt outlet. If we're not utilizing that, just close the door and just gives it that really nice presentation. We've got our T-Bar Auto uh, being a six-speed automatic. Um, we can drive it as a normal auto, bring it across into sport mode if we wish to, and that enables us to change through the gears manually by use of the lever. Cup holders behind that, handbrake to the right-hand side, and a generous storage compartment in here with the remote control for our DVD player, which we'll touch on uh, momentarily. Uh, USB and auxiliary inputs there as well. Also, as you can see, just scanning around the inside of the car, being a titanium, full leather interior. So front, second and third row seats, all full leather. And of course, uh, as I mentioned, being the uh, titanium, fitted with a DVD player as well, with the drop down screen there, our remote control as you saw, um, and then of course uh, just uh, fire up the DVD, the kids will be quiet and away we go. Next thing I'll uh, touch on, or before I go to the service history, uh, airbag safety, it does have six airbags, front, side and curtain airbags, does give it a five star and cap safety rating. Service history, every 15,000 kilometres as recommended by the manufacturer, all the way through. There is a little bit of a skip where they've probably neglected to stamp the book. Um, but apart from that, um, all the way up to the current service have been done as well. So just in summary, a really nice example of a, a 2012 Ford Territory Titanium all-wheel drive six-speed auto in diesel, 2.7 litre diesel, giving us 140 kilowatts of power, 440 newton metres of torque, still delivering nine litres combined per 100 k. So really impressive car. Hope this gives you a great idea. Give us a ring on 9907055 and we'll be able to help you further.